All right, guys. So we're back again on uh, Enemy Cross Two. Um, it's still the beta. You can't. You still can't get in unless you have the beta unlocked. This Cell Games map, by the way, looks really cool. Like all the maps and visuals are updated, by the way. But um, today I'm just going to be giving you a rundown on like the levels and everything. So uh, somebody told me that the levels were actually like if you want levels, you have to win a game. One of the admins told me that. And each level is, um, like, some amount of wins, and it goes up each time. He also told me that shows just from level 1 to level 20, from, you know, when you start to level 20, is 231 wins. And he also told me from just level 99 to 100 alone is another 200 wins. This is all- this is what he told me. He just told me- a bunch about, like, what's going down. I just took an L there. Anyways, he just told me a bunch of what's going down, what's happening, and everything like that. But basically, the, um, the leveling system, even though it seems overpowered, is actually really stable. Because I just noticed that a lot of people were coming on their Discord and complaining. It's 2% per level. At 20, at level 20, you have a 40% increase on attack and 40% increase on HP, but you have to win 231 games first before you can get that boost. So think about that. From level 1 to 100, you're gonna have to win like 2,000 games just to be able to get the 300% boost, which if you didn't know, at level 100, you actually get a 300% boost on your HP and uh, attack stat. But anyways, um, also, the uh, I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now, there is a poll going on for the exclusive character, and it looks like right now Ultra Instinct Goku is winning this poll, and um, and you cannot get this exclusive character. I have to like I want you guys to know this so you don't get mad when you don't get it. This exclusive character will only be unlocked if you spent the 300 on the closed beta. I'm pretty. That's how that works. It's only for closed beta testers. Normal beta, when the open beta comes out, that's when the closed beta testers get their thing. So if you're in the open beta, you will not actually be getting the, um, you know, the, the stuff. You won't actually be getting Ultra Instinct Goku if that's, like, your favorite character and you wanted Ultra Instinct Goku. Um, but the poll was, you, it was either we get Ultra Instinct Goku, Goku Black, or, um, Jiren. And we ended up choosing... Ultra Instinct Goku, I'm pretty sure, which was what it came close to. Sorry if there's a noise, there's a bike pulling in outside. But anyways, um, yeah, Ultra Instinct Goku seems to be the winning factor right now. And when Ultra, if Ultra Instinct Goku wins, I don't think they're going to make him available. They may at some point, but I don't think they're going to make him available from like the start of the game for new players. I think it's only for closed beta testers, and that would be it. Because, um, because it, it wouldn't make sense to me to have the pull for the beta testers and everything for the actual characters and then have the pull, like, you know, just have them, other people be able to get the character. So if you want Ultra Instinct Goku, you have to pay the 300. Also, another thing is, He's eventually going to make it where you can take your coins and you can put them into levels. So like if you want if you wanted this character to go up another if you wanted your Natsu or your Luffy or Ichigo or Naruto or Goku or anything like that to be boosted up higher, you could spend coins in them. Now I don't think the coins are actually going to be, you know, they like I don't think that's going to be until, um, when open beta comes out. And when open beta comes out, I'm pretty sure all the coins get reset. Now, your stats don't. Like, um, basically what's happening is, I believe the week of open, uh, beta, which is next week, where everybody can join, we get the exclusive character, we get 2,000 coins free, um, but we do get to keep our stats on our characters. So, like, my level th 15 Natsu will still be level 15, but I just won't have, um, 8,000 less coins if I get more than that then you know what I mean. But basically I'll be losing coins. So um yeah. Another thing that I wanted to point out is uh 
Oh, that's it. So after they choose the Ultra Instinct and the open beta comes out, when you're playing the open beta, I believe at that point they're um like you like like I said, all the, everything's going to be reset. So I don't and I think what they're gonna do is they're gonna have you reselect a character randomly for open beta. Like if you play played in closed beta. I'm not positive on that, so don't quote me on exactly what I'm saying here. But I'm pretty sure that's what they're doing, because it wouldn't make sense to be able to, you know, actually keep the character. Like, if you unlocked every character, and then you go into the next game, and you already have every character, it would be pretty overpowered, because then nobody else would have those characters. But yeah, in, in my opinion, it just seems like that, um... It's, it would just seem too way too overpowered if, uh, you know, we were able to keep all those. You know what I mean? Beat him, beat him, beat him, beat him. Okay, sweet. Alright. So, sorry about not talking. I was in a... Ah, oh, crap. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <sighs> but anyways, that's what I want to tell you guys about the levels. And, um, character-wise, they have not... They've said what characters are going to be coming out. Like, they're just, like, presuming. They're like, for example, there will be... Jiren, Goku, Ultra Instinct, Goku, Goku Black, and all the, a whole bunch of other characters for just the Dragon Ball Super timeline, which you're going to be doing for Naruto, Ichigo, Luffy, and Natsu's, you know, thing. Fairy Tail, Bleach, um, Naruto, and One Piece. They're going to be doing all of it. But basically, um, right now, the characters that you can choose from, in my opinion, I love Natsu just because... His, his, his roar is so, it does, like, it's an area of damage, and it does, I believe it does two damage for me right now, or something like that, at the level I'm at, but, um, I believe that's how that works, but also, um, Ichigo, like, I, I'm gonna probably show you guys, I could probably show you guys Ichigo, or no, I'll just throw you Luffy, because I know people wanted to see Luffy. Like, I, I'm pretty, I had a, somebody ask on, when I did my first video about Luffy. So, um, but Luffy, uh, just recently, on that latest update, got a nerf on his, um, punch attacks, and he also got a nerf on his, like, um, Gatling gun punches. So he is very weak right now. Like, he's, he was nerfed. He was the first character to be nerfed. And then there was, um, a nerf on locking. Like, um, before you could lock onto somebody who's all the way across the map. And now they have to be a certain range. And he added cooldowns on the punches and everything. So there's a lot of just, you know, just a lot of things being updated, fixed, and everything right now. So, okay, so we're going to team deathmatch here. I've never used him before, so I'm not actually positive how. But yeah, so that's his Z move. This is his X move. And then his C move was gonna be the Gatling piss. This. This is the thing that got buffed. It only does one damage now, and it's and it's easier to get out of. Before, you could barely get out of it, like, and it did a crap ton of damage. But, um, oh, God, I missed. But, yeah, I'm going to go in second gear in a second here. I'm going to start fighting this dude. Ah, it's so hard to hit that because if they're moving, it's so easy to dodge. Oh crap, I didn't do this. Wait, stop, stop. Get out of it. No. Crap, I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. Alright, here's gear two. Gear second. Okay. Uh, it looks like we're gonna win this, although a lot of our people have low HP. Okay, it's just Goku, I believe, so that's all we gotta beat is Goku. Oh, what is that? Wait, why is the gun gun pistol so... 
I can't even see my punches, so... Was that broken? I think it might have been broken. I think I might have broken it. But, um... But yeah, guys. So that is, like... That was showing you Luffy. Um, I'm not gonna do the, all the characters right now. But, uh, that was Luffy. I'm gonna switch back to Natsu, because I need to... I want to get Natsu to level 100, and I want to show you a character that it... Like, the power of a character that's at... When he's at level 100. But for now, guys, that's all I gotta show you. When... When the open beta comes, and there's Ultra Instinct Goku, I will be showing him immediately. Like, the day that it comes out, I will try to get the video fast as fast as I possibly can out. But yeah, um, so that's gonna be the video for today, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't don't press the subscribe or like button because I, I I'm not gonna ask you to do that. I'm not cancer. Anyway, anyways, uh, see you guys later.